Today, more than half the world's population lives in urban areas. By 2030, it will be 60%. Due to climate change, the rise in temperatures and increasing urbanization, cities are more and more becoming heat islands, areas where the ambient temperature stays above the surrounding temperature. This situation leads to discomfort, disease and even death, affecting low-income and elderly people the most. At the same time, heat waves cause a tremendous need to cool the buildings down and an increase in peak electricity demand. Europe uses 5 to 6% more electricity to compensate for the heat island effect. In addition to its significant economic impact, this growth in energy consumption causes a substantial increase in greenhouse gas emissions. Yet the European Union has committed itself to reducing these emissions by 20% by 2020 from 1990 levels. Fortunately, simple and cost-effective solutions do exist. An enormous unrealized savings potential lies dormant within buildings themselves in a technique that has proven performance, cool roofing. A cool roof is characterized firstly by its high solar reflectance. That's its ability to reflect the visible infrared and ultraviolet wavelengths of the sun reducing heat transfer to the building and to the surrounding air. Secondly, by its high thermal emittance, that's the ability to help release heat, such as absorbed solar energy during the night. Cool materials may be paint coatings, membranes, treated metal roofing, special tiles or shingles. These materials are most often white, but you can find orange, blue, brown or even black products as well and they can be applied to most types of roofs. Their efficiency has been scientifically proved. Let's start off with a typical black asphalt roof. Temperatures on this type of roof can rise as high as 30 degrees Celsius above the ambient temperature during the day. By contrast, the temperature of a cool reflective roof typically increases only a few degrees, and so the heat penetrating into the building decreases. Several scientific experiments have been carried out all over Europe and the world, and the results are impressive. 30% less need to cool a building. Less electricity consumption also means fewer CO2 emissions. And because less heat is transferred into the surrounding air, the air temperature itself may be reduced by 1 to 2 degrees. Anyone enduring the heat of summer in a city will feel the difference in terms of comfort in the public space outside of the building. And that all means the heat island effect is reduced. At the same time, the life expectancy of a roof system is enhanced and expenses for maintenance by reducing thermal stress on materials are brought down. So cool roofs can be a simple and effective solution and they offer an interesting value proposition too, as they are usually not much more expensive than other roofing materials. Cool roof technologies can contribute to EU policy goals like decreasing energy consumption, reducing CO2 emissions and mitigating climate change. They enhance sustainable development and make for better buildings, leading to an improved quality of life. With clever standards and adequate financial incentives, Cool roof technologies could soon become even more widespread across Europe and the world. That's great news for building owners and users, households, businesses and governments. And it's good news for the environment. <laughs>